So you're treating more and more migraines in uh, in your practice. Yeah. Oh boy, I tell you, migraines are, are a thing that's very difficult to treat because there are so many different causes and different types of headaches. And a lot of people lump it into migraine headaches. And typically, the typical patient I see, let me tell you, they, they see a neurologist or they see their primary care doctor, they try a bunch of meds and a bunch of therapies, and a lot of times those work. Okay. But there is a huge subset of people that have jumped through all of those hoops and continue to live with persistent daily headaches. And those are patients that are in our wheelhouse. And we okay. can do a couple of unique things. Uh, believe it or not, Botox, Botox is helpful. Okay. People do it uh, you know, for wrinkles on their forehead, but it can also it be quite helpful headaches. Yeah, okay. for migraine headaches. There's nerve blocks that can be done. Um, there are these nerves on the back of the head called uh, occipital nerves, but basically they cause um, this, this type of headache. Uh, that comes up over the head. We can take you under x-ray and inject some medicine to try to turn those nerves off. Um, there's different types of interest. that works. Oh, it, it tends to work quite well. If we can find the nerve that's involved and block it, it tends to work. Um, there are different types of intravenous infusions of, of all sorts of medicines that we can try. And we do some things at our clinic in terms of an infusion of medicine that isn't necessarily done in a lot of other places in Dayton. One example is a medicine called ketamine um, that has been used to treat headaches. And that's something that, that we have, uh, we, we've done. And so for some people, it really works. For some people, it's, it's quite helpful. Um, and now there's a whole new class of medicines. Um, they got a funny name to them. They're called CGRP, some scientists. Okay. <laughs> I don't know, they named it. But this has been the first new medicine to treat migraines in about a generation, about 15 or 20 years. And those have provided some exciting opportunities. The bottom line is there's a lot of new things out there to treat migraine headaches. Uh, and there's a lot of things that we could offer a patient that's suffering and, from. And, and because headaches. insurance cover, it, it doesn't cost more to go to an interventional pain management physician. That's correct. Do you have a bias? I mean, do you think that everybody should at least, if you're in chronic pain, you should probably ask your doctor or just look for an interventional pain doc. Oh, is that I, fair to say? Oh, is that I, what I, you I believe? Totally, totally uh, believe, and I agree with that. Because uh, you work with all the spine surgeons, neurosurgeons. It's like, you know, yeah. I mean, you refer we're to all, each other. Correct. We're all, on the, we're all on the same team. Our goal is to, to get that patient uh, better and get them the relief that they need. Uh, regardless of, of you know who's doing it or what, but look, if you're suffering from pain, uh, uh, come see a pain specialist. Especially migraines. Yeah, because most people aren't going to guys like you for migraines. That's right. Right. Yeah. And They're there are there are some it. new options out there, right? And and sometimes taking a different perspective or or looking at it differently is helpful. Just like if you take your car to two mechanics, the second mechanic may look under the hood and see something different. Okay. I mean, that's an advantage of seeing uh, someone like me. So for have you seen people that have had migraines for ten years, five years? And they're diminished. Oh yeah, and that's because I know thing. they're debilitating. I, I know a woman says four days out of the month she can't even function. That's right. Because, in particular, especially the things that we do that are unique or new or different than that they've tried than what they have tried before, um, those things, those patients tend to respond quite well. Do you have clinical trials? Oh Any yeah, special all stuff? the time. Because you have all a research time. place. That's right. We're we're continuously doing research uh, on migraine headaches. We're actually doing a study right now. Um, so people using can some get in research. on that study. That's right. Okay. Yeah. And and things that aren't even available elsewhere. Correct. Is that right? That's correct. 